Hello crafty friends, it's Erica, Scrapdiva29. Welcome back to my channel. I have um, a quick project share. I had been playing with my um, SVG files. I had downloaded a few off of the Lori Whitlock um, website and I was totally inspired by my friends Shara Crane and Adriana Alvarez on Instagram. Um, they, these ladies are constantly making SVG projects and I was so inspired to create some of, of my own and play with my brother Scan and Cut. That's what I use to uh, download SVG files and cut them with. And um, so this is what I made. I made um, a couple of Valentine's Day backpacks. So I made two. This was the first one. This one was super tiny um, and it's absolutely adorable. And I just used some red twine for the little string. And it's super cute and tiny, but you can put, you know, obviously you can put a little treat in here. I have it Velcro. And I mean, you could put a little gift in there. And it's absolutely adorable. I was playing with my sewing machine, and as you can see, I kind of messed up. But I thought, you know what? It's still cute. I could still give it to somebody if I wanted. And these are the little lips from Hobby Lobby. Absolutely adorable, right? I just thought, how cute. So it was really fun to play with. And then I decided to make a larger one because. I think Adriana's backpack was definitely larger, so I had to resize it uh, to create the larger backpack, which I like this size a little bit better. But this is the way mine came out. I did use the new Hot Buy paper from Michaels. Um, I added a little gold brads. I did a little bit of sewing with my sewing machine. I added some die cuts and some bling. This little bow is a brad, I think from Hobby Lobby. And look how adorable this is. I just used this pretty gold ribbon that I had in my stash. And then I stuck on a heart bling in the back of the backpack. Again, I did a little bit more sewing on the outer and on the inside. How cute is that? I love it. It's a super cute little gift box. And I used the little, uh oh, my little sticky dot. This is the uh, little um, Velcro, I can not think. And then here's the inside. So it's a good size. You can put some treats in there for sure. I'm gonna have to fix my Velcro dot. I'll have to hot glue it so it'll stick to that brad, but um, isn't that adorable? I love it. So, so cute. So I was glad I tried that. And then I also downloaded this mailbox SVG, and this is how it looks. It stands up like that. So I added a really cute bow on the top, added some pom-pom trim to the back, and that's what it looks like. Isn't that cute? And then it has a little window where you can stick the treat in. And obviously you can stick a lot of little goodies in there, lots of candy and fun little stuff. It did come with um, a little key, which I didn't die cut out the key, but I think I still will um, and add it some, somewhere on the little um, mailbox. But I thought that was really cute. So it just stands up like that. And uh, it's absolutely adorable. I love it. And then last but not least, I had actually made this a while ago. And again, this was inspired by Adriana. <laughs> she had made this really cute um, memory decks card and I had to try it. And this is from the purse SVG file by Lori Whitlock, I believe. And I'll leave her all the links to the SVG files in case you wanna look them up um, and try it yourself. But um, yeah, she totally helped me with this. I hadn't finished decorating it, but I figured since I was showing all of my little SVG products projects, I would share this little purse memory decks that I did create um, and I will finish it because I do plan on gifting it and um, I really like how the stitching came out on this and then the gold handles with the stitching. Really, really pretty and fun. You could stick a little gift. She had an example on her Instagram feed with a little gift and it was absolutely adorable. So I knew that I had wanted to try and play with this little um, SVG file. Super, super cute. Anyway, that is my project share. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment and I'll check you guys out in my next video. Bye for now.